Hello, everyone. Have you ever had a person go to this person and that person saying negative things about you? Negative things, maybe so much of those negative things are not true. And let's say this happened to you. You may want to protect your name. You may want to protect your image. So you may go to person to person explaining things. And as it seems, what you did makes matters worse. So you may ask me, Kevin, Uncle Kev, what can I do to get over this? And you may guess what I am going to say. You need to shut your mouth. You need to be quiet. Let's say that a person has gone person to person saying this and that about you. So let's say this thing is very widespread. If someone comes to you, confronting you to see, you know, why did you do this and that? Maybe the best option at that time is to be quiet. Because even if you do say what really happened, how would that person or people really know the truth? It will be your word against your enemy's word. So what you should probably do is be quiet. And I believe in time, time tells the truth. I believe no matter how long it takes, I believe after a while, the truth is going to come out. Are you understanding what I am saying to you? So there is no point in stressing yourself out. Because of lies someone has said about you. Even if more than one person has approached you asking you if this and that is true, you can either ignore them or say, I don't have anything bad to say about that. Chances are those people are not even going to believe you even if you were to share your side of the story. I believe a liar can tell a very convincing story than probably you. So your response probably should be no response. The more lies that liar tells, soon people are going to know who that person is. If someone gets in the mud trying to wrestle you, huh, don't even step in the mud. Try your best to avoid it. I believe there are so many unhappy people out there. And some people may be jealous of you. They may wonder like, or they may think, why am I so unhappy and this person is smiling and I see this person has happiness? Like, they may be jealous of your happiness. They may want to be happy, but have a hard time in being happy. So if they see you happy, that may make them very angry. That may make them feel like, I guess, they are being cheated in life. Let a liar be found out on their own. I believe in many cases, the more lies you tell, I think eventually 
Like, I don't think a person can remember all the lies that they have told. And if you have, and if there is a person who tells many lies, I believe one piece of evidence can probably break down all of their lies. At least one piece or two pieces of evidence that goes contrary to what they have told. If someone wants to go around trying to make your name very bad as if you are this horrible person, let that person ensnare themselves with their words, with their lies. You don't have to battle with a wicked person if they choose to be that way. Let me stop here. May God bless us.